Hello everyone. Today we are going to tell you how to test this uh, treadmill motor with the multimeter. Uh, for this we have three motor now with us. This one is uh, new motor. This one is partially working, and this one uh, is totally bad. So we have a multimeter to check. Now we are going to check one by one, and I will tell you how to check this uh, motors. So this motor first I am going to check working one as you can see there is a three uh, three wires one is ground and one is uh, positive and one is negative so ground we don't need to uh, connect and this one I am connecting now this positive to the red one and negative to the black so as you can see now the meter needle is moved and I can when I move this rotate this motor it will work is go and come back go and come back like this so it's a reverse movement and forward movement so this motor is new now I'm going to check uh, the middle one this motor as I told you this is partially working uh, I will show you uh, the problem of this motor this motor have a problem uh, it will work when we rotate it so I am connecting now this prop and you can see this needle is gone now but when I rotate it is coming back like that. It's not should be come back. This motor is bad also. So this is now I will rotate it will come it will go there and it's come back and it's going there. So this is also this is the bad motor. Now the third one I am going to check. This one is as I told you totally bad. So this will have no any movement in the needle. You can see now we connect this one and you can see there is no any movement. This the wire is connected, but there is no any movement in the needle. So this motor is bad. And if you like to check the short, uh, short circuit, uh, you will check, you have to check uh, any of uh, negative or positive wire with the ground. If there is is showing, this is short, not showing. The motor is, but this is not showing, this is not short, but this motor is bad. It is not showing with the ground, but this motor is bad. So like this you have to, you can check the treadmill motor. Thanks for watching.